I'm Carl. I'm from Westerville. Uh, come over a couple days a week. What I'm working on here is the um, intersection of the dorsal fin with the vertical stabilizer. Um, this plywood template is a 140 inch radius arc and that represents the top of the dorsal fin and these are the major ribs of the dorsal. There's one more that goes back here that'll terminate these stringers. Then there's a, sh a strap that goes from these nut plates in the vertical to nut plates in the dorsal and comes up and over. The big thing we're working on or have to w solve, there is a cap that goes over here. It's similar in shape to the cap that's already been installed there where the cleat goes and the forward part is riveted. What makes this cap a, a major problem is the fact that not only has to be curved this way but it also has to be curved to fit the 140 inch radius. How we're going to do that we've been thinking about for probably three years and still I don't know how it's going to be done. Hopefully our uh, resident guru will figure it out by the time we need to do it. Uh, our next step, what we're doing now is clipping each of these ribs to the stringer and there will be clips here where this piece met, meets the uh, station 8 and then there are additional short stringers that go from this station to this station. There, there's one here and about one here and finish this out. Uh, and right now my partner and I, what we're working on is uh, getting this stringer. This stringer also is like 146 inch radius. This was hand bent here. We laid out a 146 inch arc on the floor and we used the hydraulic press and just kept stepping along and we had a um, dial indicator so we kept the same distance each time, kept bending it, going over and checking on the, the radius on the floor and these were made uh, probably close to three years ago before we had any of this together and I was amazed at how well they fit in uh, when we finally went to do the, the, the preliminary assembly. Uh, so.